It was a grey and rainy morning as the troops marched onto the parade square at Mansa Barracks in Guttersloe, but that didn't stop hundreds of loved ones turning up to see their dads, husbands or sons get presented with their well-deserved Afghanistan medals. Even the Lord Mayor of Birmingham came over from the UK to congratulate the West Midlands Regiment on such a successful tour of duty. As the Lord Mayor of, of the city where the regiment has the freedom, it's a real pleasure for me to, to be here. I'm connected with the forces through my father and through my son as well. So it means something special to, to me. I've had the opportunity today to talk to some of the men and women that have been out to, to Afghanistan. Obviously they're pleased they're back, but we're pleased that they're back as well. It's nice to see them, although I wish I'd just brought better weather with me. The 429 troops from the regiment were based at 47 different locations across Helmand. Their tasks range from mentoring the Afghans, providing fire support to the troops on the ground, to targeting the insurgents. And thankfully, all troops returned home safe and sound. We're really proud to have them home, and uh, even if the weather's rubbish, it's still nice to come and see them all, and see them all back together, and everyone back home, so they're all safe. <laughs> Absolutely great, uh, proud to get the medal. Uh, back. Good to be back home safe. Um, a couple of guys get injured out of my uh, multiple, but uh, you know they're, they're safe and life goes on now. I'm very proud. He deserved it. Yeah. The regiment will now take some R and R and look forward to the end of June when they'll exercise their right to march through the city of Birmingham. That will take place on Armed Forces Day, the 30th of June, and of course everybody is welcome to go down to support them. Laura Hawkins, Forces News, Guttersloe.